Thank you. Okay, guys. Good morning. Today, inshallah, we will take lesson five, page 547, probability of compound events. Now, in the previous lesson, guys, or lessons, we took simple events. Simple events. Simple events like when I have a coin, focus, guys, please. When I have a dice, for example, the dice, we know the sample space, it is one, two, three, four, five, six. And I roll it once. What is the probability to have four? We said we count how many fours in the sample space one over how many the whole sample space six. This we call it simple event. Simple event means one thing. I ask you about one thing. What is the probability of four? What is the probability of odd number? One thing, probability of even number. One thing. So this we call it simple events. For example, here probability of odd, how many odd numbers? Three over six means half. How many even numbers? Three over six, which is half, okay? These, what we call them, simple events. One thing. When I say a, a bag with five red, seven black, two blue. If I select one, one ball or one card, what's the probability to be black? One thing. So we have seven over the total, which is 14. Seven over 14 means half. These what we call them simple events. Simple event means they wanted from you the probability of one thing, okay? But today what we have, compound events. Compound events, we know the word compound, guys. Compound means more than one thing in general, right? I think you took something in chemistry, I think. Something similar for compounds. So compound means more than one thing. When I say compound events, means I will ask you about the probability of two things, which is very important lesson, guys. Focus, please. Focus, please. Now, before we start finding the compound events, we have things, something we call it compound experiments. Compound experiments means here I throw the dice once. I throw or I roll the dice once. This is one experiment. But if I tell you that, I will focus, guys, please focus. The following experiment. If I tell you that to sink a coin and rolling a dice. Huh. So here I have two experiments. Not one. In the previous lesson, we said, lessons, we said, if you toss a coin, find kether. If you roll a dice, find kether. Here I'm saying, if you toss a coin and rolling a dice. This we call it compound, not event, compound experiment, means more than one experiment. The first thing, how I will find the sample space, which is very important here. Because without the sample space, we cannot know the events. But what the event? The event is the something which the question asked me about. Here, this for, we call it event. Event is a part from the sample space. So if you know the sample space, it's easy to find the probability. So how we know the sample space? Look here, guys, and focus. To know the sample space of this example or this compound experiment, look at what I will do. Sample space. And the sample space is the set 
of all the possible outcomes, Meshek. This is equal. Now I have two, two types or two parts. The first is tossing a coin once. But if you toss the coin once, what is the possibilities? Either head or what? Meshek. Multiply. The second one, which is rolling a dice. If you roll a dice once, what are the possibilities? One, two, three, four, five, six. So to find the sample space, I will put the sample space of the first experiment, multiply the sample space of the second experiment. You will ask me, Mister, how you multiply this with this? These are two grooves. What's the multiplication of the grooves? Look how I multiply grooves. This is equal. And focus with this one, please. This is equal. I will start with the first element here and pass it through all the other elements in the second group. Means head with one. How our Write it like this, bracket, head, comma, one. Close the bracket, comma. Now head with what? With two, I'll write it like this. Head, comma, two, close the bracket. Head with three. Head, comma, three, close the bracket. Head with four. Close the bracket. Head with five. Close the bracket. Head with six. Close the bracket. Do I finish? No. I finished the first element. Now I will do the th same thing for the second element, which is the tail. Tail with one, tail with two, tail with three, tail with four, with five, with six. This we will finish. So tail with one. Tail with two, tail with three, tail with four, and tail with six. This here, what we call it, sample space of this compound experiment. Five. How many elements in the sample space? How I will count the elements? I will not count like this. One, two, three, four, no. This, we call it one element. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, seven, eight. No, I forget till, till with five here, guys. Wait. Till with five. I didn't write it. So we have till with five, then till with six, right? Now let's count. One. Don't count one, two, three, four. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. But can I know the number of the sample space before I write it? Yes. How many elements here? Two. How many elements here? Six. Two multiply six, twelve. So to find the sample space of compound experiment, we found the sample space of each one, then we multiply them like this. How we multiply, we pass each element in the first set or a group on all the elements on the second group. And we put them like this, ordered pairs with comma between them. Yani, خليك مرتب, عشان ما تخربط. Head one, head two, بالترتيب, let, let, تطلع ولا تنزل بالترتيب head with one head with two head with three مع بعض كملت الهيد روح على التيل تيل with one تيل with two تيل with three until you finish what we call this now this is here the sample space not this this is the first step this is not the sample space this is the sample space طب I want a student to talk with me 
وليد وعبد الله بس مستر وليد yeah. انسى اللي تحت هذا وركز معي فوق اوكي اوكي Yeah. To sing a coin and rolling a dice, give me one possibility of the outcome. To sing a coin and rolling a dice. Yani if you toss a coin, what you will have? A uh, head or tail. Give me one. Ma hu ya head ya tail. Ma bzuqsh litnet abad, sa? Head. Head. Rolling a dice. Give me a number. Uh, six. Six. So, Walid, guess. Ha, Walid. Guest, guest. That tossing a coin and rolling a dice, we will have head and what? Six. Six, Six. right? Yeah. Do we have it here? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. But Abdullah. Yes. Guess an outcome. Tossing a coin, rolling a dice. Guess anyone in your mind what you will have? Tails and two. Tail with two. Do we have it? Yes. yes. طب, another one. Another one. Abdullah. Um, heads with five. Heads with five. Abdullah, do you wait? Heads with five. Do we have it? Sure. We should be. Abdullah, Bawadi. Guess outcome for this experiment. Heads with uh, six. Head with six. Walid. Tails with one. Let's talk heads, guys. Let's heads. Tails. How tails. many? How many head on the coin? One. One. No S. Okay. Yell. Tail with what? Tail with one. Tail with one. Do we have it? Yes. Yes. Means. When I say sample space, guys, this is the set of all, uh, all the possibilities. مستحيل يطلع شيء in this experiment not exist here. لازم يكون موجود هون. لهيك اسمه إيش؟ sample space. Now, if I have the sample space, it's easy to find Probability of compound events. Look what I will ask you now here. Look, guys. Find B of uh, head with odd number. Hmm. How we find the probability, guys? We count the event. This is the compound event. I will ask myself, how many head and odd numbers here I have? Let's count. One, head and one, head and odd. Two, head and odd. Yes. three, and then four. Odd. Three elements. Let it say here one, two, three. La, hada, one element, one outcome. One, two, three, head with odd. Hi, three. But why I didn't take tail with the three? Three is odd. Because the question won't head with odd only. See over what? The whole sample space outcomes. How much? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve. Twelve. Simplify it one over four. But if I ask you, find probability of a head or tail, huh? head. Or tail with a number less than four. Practice. With the hood, head or tail and a number less than four, which tossing a coin, head or tail and a number less than that four. I will count. But each one I see it here, I take a look here and be sure that. It is satisfies it, satisfy it, right? I want head or tail with a number less than four. This one, I will take it. Head with one, the one less than four. One, two, three. I won't take this one. Yes. Because this four, it has head, but the four is not less than four. The five, not less than four. The six, not less than four. 
So one, two, three. Head or tail? One, two, three. How many? Six. Six over twelve. Six the whole. Over twelve. Uh, one hard. over two. Means to find the probability of compound events, you need to what? You need to try to write the sample space. Example. And focus, guys, please, please. Example. F, ha. Rakzum ayahalla. To sing a coin. Metaudin nehki once, right? To sing a coin once. Guess yes. was in the simple events. Here I will say twice. Twice. Twice means I will do the experiment two times. I will toss the coin, the first one, then I will record my result. Then I will toss the coin, the second one, then I will write the result, which means it is compound, not symbol. But how I will write the sample space? I will say sample space equal. By the way, in math, sample space, the shortcut of it, this sign. And this sign, we call it omega. When you say something like this, omega means it is sample space, but it's okay. Just memorize it as sample space. But let's write the sample space for this compound, compound uh, experiment. Tossing a coin twice, stop. The first one, if you toss a coin, what is the possibilities? Either head or okay. tails. Yes. Multiply. The second time, this is for the first time, هو حكى لك twice. لو قال لك tossing a coin once, خلص. هو once. ارميها مرة بسجل وانسى الموضوع. But here we have it twice. This is the first time. The first time, all the possibilities, head or tail. But the second time, also head or tail. Head or tail. Each time you toss the coin, each time you toss the coin, you either has head or what? Tail. Or tail. Yes. But now let's find. Do we find the sample space? Not yet. I'm preparing it. This is equal to pass head with head together. You can write it like this. You can write it like this. Or, or head with tail. Head with tail. Look, head, head. But then head, tail. Huh? Then tail with tail. خلصنا الهيد. وين الروح؟ The second tail. element, do the same. Tail, head, tail, head. tail. tail. Yes. tail head, and tail, tail. tail, tail. But thank you guys. Now, let me ask Mr. Yazan. Yes, Mr. Yazan, if you toss a coin twice, give me a possibility of an outcome. You will get um, head and tail. Yes. Do we have it, head and tail? Yes. Hey. But what is the difference, guys, between head, tail, and tail, head? Should we tell from about The same thing. No. It is not the same. Head and tail means at the first time you get head, and at the second time you get tail. Tail and head means at the first time you get tail, at the second time you get head. They are totally different. So either, guys, look here, if you toss a coin twice, either you get two heads, two tails, one head and one tail, one tail and one head, and all of them are here. This is what we call it, sample space of compound experiment. Now, after I find the sample space, I can ask you what I want about this one. For example, 
if I want the probability, find probability of two heads. Uh, How many two heads we have? One over four. One over four. But probability of huh, tail at least at least track is tail oh, yeah. at least once. Our issue was the of at least. When I say at least once, greater than or equal. One, right? Yani, ya one, ya a'la, shake. At least once, and we have two times. So either one or what? Or two. Or one. Do we have tail here? No. No. One. One and more. Two. One. Three. Three. So we have a three over. Four. four. By the way, this is 0 0.25. This is 0 0.75. 75. Yeah. Means, guys, to know the probability of any compound event, any compound event, if you write the sample space correctly, to find the compound event, you need just to count. It's so simple. But if you write the sample space, if you just try to imagine, ah, oh, wallahi, yalla, coin with the dice. It's not valid. Try to write the sample space. If you write the sample space, everything will be easy. Just count, uh, counting and divide. This is the idea of your lesson. I don't know, by the way, what is inside it, actually. But this is my way. Huh? This is my way to write the sample space. The book has another way. We call it three way. Three way. Actually, I don't like it. And my way is easier. Now let's see the book, how he, or how the book make the sample space. Look here. Okay, guys. This experiment, see this experiment? It is coin with number, number cube. cube. Coin with number cube. I did it here. See it? I yeah. did it here. This one is easier, I think. So use yeah. this one. Okay. So look at the answers, guys, here. Look here. Look here. Head one, head two, head three, head four, head five. Sah? Tail yes. one, tail two, tail three, right? These are them, head one, head two, head three, but in other form, in another way, I multiply the groups. To you know the number of the sample space, guys, you just multiply the number of each experiment alone. Means the coin has two, the dice has six. If you multiply them, you get 12. Means the sample space should has 12 elements. Here to think a coin twice. The first one, two. The second one, two. Two multiply two, four. The sample space has one, two, three, four. Got it? But who can tell me, if you roll a dice twice, what is the sample space number of outcomes? Rolling a dice twice how many elements or outcomes elements outcomes in the sample space 20 oh, but... huh. put your hands guys if you know the answer اللي حكى 12 هذا بفرجيكم فيك بس كمان شوي. Who know? If you roll the dice twice, what is or how many outcomes? I don't want the sample space. 
I want how many outcomes in the sample space, okay? 36. 36. Why 36? Because you roll a dice twice. The first one, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. The second time, also you have six. One, two, three, four, five, six, which is 36 outcomes. So you can know the number of the outcomes without doing the sample space like this. يعني مش لازم تعمل وتعده. No. No. Do not add, Mr. Yazan. Do not add. You multiply, okay? You multiply. This is how we do sample space and how we find compound probabilities of compound experiments. If you have any questions, guys, put your hand. If you don't remove your hand so I can manage, please. <clears throat> Mr. Yazan or Abdullah. Yes, Yazan, what's your question? Uh, Mr. It was in the homework. Khalak in the homework, Hala. I'm talking about this one. Here, do you understand everything? Yeah, yeah. Abdullah. Yes, Mr. What's your question, Yabni? I don't have a question. ليش حاط يدك طيب عبد الله؟ ما هو ها زعلوا الواحد منكم مش محطوطة كانت محطوطة يا عبد الله شلتها طيب We have time right guys مستر We have time مستر We have time right يلا let's do example yeah. one let's go to our book now to do example one يلا Let's go to our book to do example one. Who can read, guys? Yeah, I want a new students. Let's not be sharko. Let's. Let's not be sharko. Ah, Faris. Example one. Find the surface space of. Ali, what are you doing? Which page? 549. 549, yeah. Example one. Find the separate space of combat agents. <sighs> yeah. Suppose. Suppose a penny and a nickel are tossed. Suppose a penny and a nickel are tossed. Coins, right? Coins, yes. So you are tossing. A coin and another coin, right? Yes. So you are tossing two coins, right? Yeah. The first possibilities or outcomes for the first coin, what are they? Uh, 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 heads or tails? Head or not heads, yabni. One head, one. Head or tail. The second uh, one, the nickel also. Head or tail, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, what is? What is the sample space of possible outcomes? Hey. We did it. To sing a coin twice, it is the same of to sing two coins once. Nafsa. To sing a coin twice. It is the same of tossing a coin tw uh, once. Two coins once. Got it? Pass. The first coin is what? Penny. El penny is fi. Ya head. Ya tail. Right? Yeah. The second coin, the nickel. Ya head. Ya tail. Right? Yeah. So this is the sample space of tossing. A penny and a coin once, right? Yeah. Do you understand it? Yes. 
Let's see the book, guys. The book, the book did all of these steps here. And look at the outcomes here. Look here, guys. Here, the result. See the result in the table. Hello. Yes, yes. يا ابني ركز معي ورد علي الله يخليك لا تخليني احكي مع محالي اه يلا at the first one heads heads right yeah second heads tails heads tails heads قول له باي لاخوك fourth tails so head head او head tail أو تيل هيد أو تيل تيل رايت؟ يا هيد 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 تيل تيل هيد تيل تيل رايت؟ يا إتس ذا سيم إتس ذا سيم ذيس إز إكزامبل 1 جايز بس أي أدد هاو تو فايند بروبابيلتيز أوكي؟ أني كوشنز جايز أني كوشنز بليز أني كوشنز بليز Can you if you have any questions, put your hand. What? Can you show me the answer of example one in the book? It's your book. Hi, hey, book. Head, 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 tail, tail, head, out, tail, tail, right? Yes. It is the same of this, but we make it more easy. That's all. Guys, don't forget the sign of the groups, huh? It's important. Open a group, close the group. Open a group, close the group. Don't forget these signs. It's important in your math language. This is, we call it math language, okay? If you open a group or bracket or parentheses, you need to close it. Bizbotash. Yan bizbotash goal, bracket, two multiply three plus seven, wa kammel, wa ro khalas, one sa, bizbotash. بيبرد هذا لازم تغطيه. طيب. Any questions? فارس. Oh sorry, I left I left my hand. Any questions, guys, about these ideas which we discussed yesterday? I did only example one. Tomorrow we will continue. Because I have not in the in this. Uh... طيب. Let's go to which uh, the homework, Ebni? Yes, the homework. Yeah. Page 545. Yeah. Which one? Sura. Question two. Question two. Two experiments. Yeah. Uh, the idea, صح? Yes. Spinner with equal size sections. خلاص. Equal size sections. And the second one, a card randomly selected from a bag containing Five A cards, three B cards, four C cards, and one D cards. I'm asking you now, Mr. Yazan, do the cards in experiment two have the same chance to be happen? Yes. Allah is Samhak. Yazalame A three five cards or B three cards. Ilhom nafs chance hadol? No. طيب كيف يس ها وهذا اسمه عدم التركيز احنا ما بنركز but look at the first one what they say uh, equal side means they have the same chance to happen here they have different chance يعني ال a5 cards تطلع على ال d كم 1 وان لهم نفس التشانس هذول؟ لا تعال شوف الدي تحت قد ايه؟ صغير 1 صح؟ يس يعني لو بوسيبيلتي بس اي هاي بوسيبيلتي سو جراف 2 شود بي فور اكسبيريمنت 2 اند جراف 1 وذ ايكوالي سايز مينز ذا بروبابيلتي شود بي نير تو ايتش اذر شود بي فور اكسبيريمنت 1 بس A graph one for experiment one, a graph two for experiment two. Okay, thank you. Else, guys, any questions?
Don't forget, guys, we stopped at example one. Today, we will start from the check of example one, I think, in Thursday. Then I will finish the lesson, inshallah. Study these examples. I will send it to your inbox after a while. Thank you so much, and have a nice day. Goodbye.